Okay, Ralph, so far you have showed me uh, how to record the motor characteristics and also load emulation. What are you going to show me now? I would like to go and show you now how the motor is starting. So mm -hmm. see all the values during the motor starting and coming to the nominal speed. So therefore we go to the time diagram and then we can choose here also a load. For demonstration a good load would be inertia wheel. So and we can hear this flywheel and so we will set up the size of the flywheel. I know that we need about 1000 uh, kilogram centimeter quadrat which is the value of the flywheel. And then we can enable the flywheel here and then I will set up also the measurement here. On the x-axis we have now the time and here we have all the values. So I will change the measuring time for example to five seconds. Then we have the possibility for the trigger functionality. So okay I would like to trigger for speed or torque. Mm -hmm. If I choose torque then I have this markers here and then I can move it move it here mm -hmm. and also for the timing I can move it a little bit. Say record and now I can switch on the motor. And then I can get the starting characteristic of the motor. Okay. I need to double click here to adjust the starting torque. For example, it could be interesting to see also the current. Let's have to select the current for the correct value. Let's say 10 amps. And so I see the dynamic behavior of the starting of the motor. Okay, until it is uh, reached to the nominal speed. Yeah, correctly. Mm -hmm. Here I have select RMS values. Mm -hmm but I can also deselect this value so I get the actual values so I see also the scene wave of the current. For example I will do the measuring again. I will change the time and doing the same setup for example for a host drive which wants the motor to nominal talk about I will clear the characteristic here, press enable again, say OK, pressing record and, and now we can switch it on. And so we see directly also the rush in Karen of the system. To make it a little better I will also say here minus one th one, 10 amps. And here you can see very nice how the motor is switched in and how it's starting the motor. 